<clears throat> hey, what's up, guys? It's Dan from Spaghetti Code. It's been a long, long time since I've posted on this channel, and we're about to revive it. So bear with me over the next month. It's been a crazy year or so. I got a lot going on. Uh, there's also two other channels that maybe I'll link in the description. One is where I talk about mm, e waste and things. Uh, and the other one's completely unrelated, so we don't have to link that one. Uh, but that channel's called One Man's Waste, so if you want to look it up, because I may forget to link it. Um, okay, so the reason I thought, wow, I should really come back on here, is I encountered a tech problem yesterday, and I'm going to try to replicate it, because I searched high and low for solutions, and uh, I couldn't find anything, and I ended up figuring it out. I looked and looked and looked on YouTube and I couldn't find the right answer. And it turns out uh, that my situation was unique and different and so hopefully this works for you guys. Okay, so I have here this HP Pavilion G7. And uh, when I turn it on, and let's see if it'll do it, most of the time, it's just getting stuck at this blue HP logo. And it stays here. And it stays here and stays here. So I had no idea why that was happening, right? I was getting really frustrated. I'm on Google. Google's, you know, sending me to these YouTube videos. The YouTube videos are saying to press Windows B and then hold power to turn it on and recover the BIOS. I can't get that to do anything. That wasn't working for me. Um, so I was like, man, what is really going on with this thing? Okay. I'm gonna tell you what happened. I'm gonna turn this off, I want you to watch this. So I'm gonna hard power down. Now, for whatever reason, I tore it back apart, and when I plugged it back in together, for whatever reason, right? It's hard to do this one-handed. But for whatever reason, uh, I just wanted to try that Windows B power thing again, whoops without the battery in. Well, without the battery in, uh, it actually went past it. So I, man, I think this is a battery problem. All right, hard drive people, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm gonna unplug this so that I can do this. I have here two batteries. This is the bad battery that was in there. I'm gonna pop this battery in just so you can see. That battery is not a bad battery. Okay, so there we go. We'll pop her back in, plug her in, we'll wait a second, and then we'll hit power. And you will see once again, this is the battery that was in when it froze. Um, and then we pop up, and we go right to booting Windows. So, if you are, if you are getting stuck at the HP logo screen, um, and refreshing the BIOS is not working for you, then I would urge you to first try to remove your battery. It should work, but either way, I really would urge you to pop on Amazon. You can get this battery for about, uh, well, they're, they're gonna vary, but most of the time you can get like an aftermarket battery for 12 to $20 shipped free with Amazon Prime. You'll have it in two days. You should be able to use your computer again the second you take the battery out, though it should boot um, to Windows without a battery in. We are booting, just so you know, I can see the cursor there. So that's the fix, holy crap. Not a single video on YouTube alluded to that being a fix. So I um, hope you enjoy it. Um, you're gonna see a lot more videos coming. Look, there we go, boom, we are booted to Windows. You're gonna see a lot more videos coming. Um, this started out as a small shop out of my old apartment four years ago. When I started this channel, it was out of my apartment in 2013. Um, I've moved and then I opened this shop where I do all this tech work. So uh, we do an awful lot of stuff in here now and there's actually uh, four people that work for me. We're working on making a green screen room in the very back. So there's gonna be a lot more to come and it's not gonna be just me anymore there's going to be um me and three to four different hosts so we've got a lot of cool things planned if you haven't liked and subscribed up to this point uh 
please uh, click down below that doesn't just support me. Uh, eventually, you know, if I ever get monetized, that will help to support the people that work for me too. So uh, like and subscribe, and I, I hope that we can continue to provide you good content. Uh, we are going to continue to try to give you solutions on this channel, but we're going to try to change the format so that it's a little bit more fun. Also, we're going to do yet another channel where it shows the like the ins and outs of the daily life inside the background of a tech shop. So um, there's going to be quite a bit of humor involved in that because sometimes this job is downright horrible. But uh, thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys next time.